that's tough for Walden. Polanco Whoa. lifts one deep to right field, and he just changed the complexion of this game with one very important swing to the upper deck in Houston. It's 5-3 to three when they need it at most. One of their longest tenured twins comes up clutch. You know what I'm thinking about right now? Are you sure? <laughs> I'm thinking about, yeah. Hey, leave your starters in the game. I always say it, but but you know, who knows what would happen? He comes back out. But Justin Verlander was cruising. He knew he was cruising. You want to take me out? Are you sure? Now you're thinking, well, maybe I should have left him in. I don't know. The swing they needed to get back in it. Here's Lewis. Strike. Outside. Or no, thought it was a strike. It was outside. Beg your pardon. One and zero. Oh. I don't think he liked that one very much. Altuve is <laughs> like, oh, baby, that one went a long way. Polanco's a hard guy to game plan. He does so many different things. Lewis lifts one now. Back to back go the Twins, and we've got a one-run game here in game one. His third postseason home run. And the Twins shocking the Houston bullpen in the seventh. It's not the Bomba squad of four years ago, but this team can punch it. And two huge swings has made it a one-run game. Couple things. Behind in the count, 2-0 to Polanco. Had to throw a fastball. 1-0 to Royce Lewis. Threw him a fastball. Both middle, middle kind of up. Two home runs for the Twins. They're back in the game. The land of 10,000 rakes has traveled south, and Royce Lewis continues to swing a hot bat.